Hi everybody, this is Sam with Python Basics, and we are going to continue with where we left off last time with Pygame. We're going to look at um, more at the font library, and this video is going to peek at the get fonts method. So, all right, let's just get right to it. Pygame. Oops, if you can spell game right. Um, and if you're new here, uh, thanks for joining us. And if you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell. But what what we do here is we do micro videos, and we only do one subject matter at a time, so it's always searchable. So all right, so we've already imported that. So let's look closer at pygame.font. And we are going to look at get fonts right here. And so let's let's see what it does, and I'll just show you. So pi game. Actually, let's run help on it. Pi game dot font dot get underscore fonts. Close it out. Okay. So what does it do? Pygame.font.getfonts list gets a list of system font names, returns a list, all found system fonts. Note that the name will be all lowercase with spaces removed. Okay, so what does that mean? Well, how about we call it and just check it out. Pygame.font.get underscore, my goodness, font, is it font or fonts? Fonts, boom. Well, I can't read that. And if we look real close, okay, you can still see that. That is crazy. And let's see. It doesn't even look. No, I think I looked last time. So, all right. Fonts equals high game dot font dot get fonts. So let's look and see what I'm doing. It's all right. Fonts dot sort. Boom. Fonts. So I just put them in alphabetical order. So I want to show you just so I don't know how well you are with fonts. I know like two of them. But remember how it said remove the spaces? I'm sure everybody knows Times New Roman. So that's why I put this in alphabetical order. Because uh, before I did this, I tried to find it. And it was all jumbled. But you could also do use your in keyword. But also just remember that it said that the spaces removed. So all right. So this is get fonts method from the Pygame excuse me, pygame.font module. So as always, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Um, thanks for giving all the awesome comments. So if this is the type of video you like, go ahead and give me a thumbs up on it. And if you've not subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notification bell because I don't want you missing anything or getting behind or feeling overwhelmed. That's the point of this channel. We just do micro videos so you don't feel overwhelmed and you can come <clears throat> excuse me and you can come back and search for them and please don't hesitate to leave any comments questions or any video requests because somebody else might have the exact same question and you'd be helping somebody else out so that's the way I want you guys to think about it so as always thanks for watching stay tuned and we'll see you next time bye guys